Hey guys, we're out in the yard. Um, wanted to share some, just some random things with you guys today. Um, we're going to be putting down another application of Melorganite. Um, and we're going to be putting down um, some RGS products. Um, some next products from, from Green County Fertilizer. Um, going to be putting that down in the yard. So, uh, just, you know, random stuff. Uh, kind of a, the day in the life in the lawn. Um, uh, you know, can you guys hear the the locust or cicadas? Um, out? I mean, our neck of the woods, those things are crazy this year. I don't know what's going on. Um, let me know in the comments if you guys have those in your area. Um, but, I mean, they're loud and they're ugly and, you know, it looks like, uh, uh, you know, a mass death has occurred in the mornings on our, on our concrete. It just is overall crazy. So, um, I digress. So let me uh, show you guys my my uh, um, lineup of, of stuff that we're doing today. One second. All right, so we've got uh, good old Melorganite here. Um, I know I've done a past video on that that I'll link below that you guys can uh, check out if you want, but good stuff. Um, also put a little uh, picture up here of, of um, my lawn treatment plan. I know I've talked about that a few times. Um, and I plan to kind of cover that on what I do when uh, throughout the lawn. Um, so, so look for a video coming on that too. Um, so, wanted to show you the the spreader that I use. Um, it is uh, an Earthway spreader. Works fantastic. Um, it's the 2600A plus. Um, it's got a little deal here. Um, underneath where you can flip a leather lever and it keeps uh, the product from from going out one side of the spreader so you aren't uh, fertilizing your neighbor's yard which is uh, a good thing or, or, or throwing stuff in your in your garden beds or out on the concrete or, or what have you so we're going to be using that and uh, the lineup for Green County for today's app is we're going to be putting down the what people some people call I guess the liquid gold or whatever the RGS and, and aerate so this is the root growth stimulator I'm gonna push those roots way down deep um, into the soil uh, fantastic stuff and aerate um, liquid aeration um, I mean I have found that it works really really well um, it's softened up a whole lot of spots in my yard I, I put it everywhere um, in my yard and um, you know not only do you get the the benefits of liquid aeration you also get a, a nice pop of green um, in your lawn just got a little bit of, of uh, product in that so I had to pull out a new canister so uh, that's kind of the the uh, products that we're gonna be putting down today so with that um, you know we're gonna start with the uh, Melorganite um, I'll fill up the, the ooh, sun's bright there I'm gonna fill up the uh, the spreader and I'll set you guys up so you can kind of watch that product go down and then we'll move on to mixing up the the next products and I'll kind of give you guys a, a quick view on on how I go about doing that too uh, so um, on to my work tonight So guys, I want to show you a couple of spots that uh, got some damage in our lawn uh, just from the, the hot summer, um, along with where we're going to be doing some some seeding and um, putting down some of our Jonathan Green Black Beauty Ultra um, seed here in the, the coming weeks, uh, just to clear up some damage and then also to fix where we have some some uh, stones in our in our lawn that seemed like a great idea initially uh, when we built our home but I'm just not liking it it makes it hard to, to aerate around it and the, the type of turf that we have you know wants to grow up around it so you're always having to trim it so I'm going to take those out and plant grass in those areas too but let me show you this 
So here you can see are some spots that are, are thin and uh, need to be reworked. New seat put down on them. But here is all of our pavers that we have. It's kind of a walkway that are just a pain in the neck. Um, so I'm going to be pulling those out, putting some new seed uh, down um, in that place and just getting rid of them. We'll use these, these stones somewhere else in the yard um, in the, the coming period just to, to make things life easier in the lawn. But wanted to update you on one thing that we are going to be doing. So we've got this pathway that uh, or, 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 our front rock that uh, we um, have. So I'm going to be putting on each side of this um, about, about a three foot bed on each side. Uh, I'm going to be kicking out all of this turf all along through here and we're going to be replacing it with this uh, Munstead lavender that I have um, a few instances of over here that is just um, amazing. You can see you know the butterflies and the bees just love it but I like how airy it is and, and just how uh, how great it looks and, and our and our David Austin roses here are, are doing fantastic first year brand new plantings you know, as you can see we got um, gorgeous bloom you know right there they're just they're awesome so you need to check those guys out so on to the next thing we're gonna be uh, putting together um, our our next products that we're going to spray down. Hey guys, um, you'll see that I'm wearing a different shirt today. That's because uh, yesterday's video um, it ran into some audio issues. So you'll see right up there I'll kind of insert a video of me just jabbering on and none of the audio worked. So we're back to another day. Um, so what I did yesterday that uh, the footage didn't have any audio on it was that I put down the air rate at six ounces uh, per thousand square foot and I put down the um, RGS at three ounces per thousand square foot so um, today we're going to be putting down some humic 12 from next at three ounces per square foot and then microgreen also at three ounces per square foot so we'll cover that um, but right now we're going to get um, some mowing on, hashtag enjoy the mow, um, and then what we'll do is we'll come back and uh, put down the RGS products. So, we've got microgreen, we've got humid 12, um, battery pack sprayer. If you guys don't have one, I'll link it below. This one's from Sprayers Plus. Um, it's the two gallon sprayer. Fantastic for this kind of work. Um, the magic behind a, a battery pack sprayer is that you don't have to worry about all of the pumping and all of that kind of stuff. It just keeps the pressure in there and, and works like magic. So I'll put a link below uh, to those guys where you can check that out. Um, but let's get this mixed up. So 
So that's really it guys, you know, you just give it a good shake inside of the, the canister and spray it down. Um, I'll include some footage here of uh, me putting the product down yesterday. Alright, that's about it for today guys, so sorry about the, the outfit change there, um, hopefully I got that all, all the issues worked out there, um, but really just wanted to share with you guys what was going on this week, We're putting down some Next products, and um, getting our, our Mo on, and putting on uh, some, uh, some Morganite, so all good stuff, and we should see the yard popping here uh, real soon. So be sure to like, subscribe uh, below, uh, leave us some comments, uh, let, let us know what you guys think, and um, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks a lot.